Thomas, Adelaide Crows football coach Graeme Corns, and children's entertainer Peter Coombe. The 1991 Alcohol Awareness Week was launched at the Adelaide Town Hall and hosted by the Lord Mayor Steve Condis. Personalities in attendance included John Schumann, Graeme Corns, Ken Cunningham, and the Minister for Occupational Health and Safety, Mr Bob Gregory. For your information, the organising committee of Alcohol Awareness Week consists of uh, representatives from the South Australian Police, Carlin Hospital, Ansvar Insurance Company, the Alcohol and Drug Foundation of Australia, People Against Drink Driving, Drug and Alcohol Services Council, the Salvation Army Bridge Program and See It Believe It Television. We thank those people for their continued support. It's my pleasure now to call on the Chairman of the Organising Committee and I might say the actual inspiration behind Alcohol Awareness Week in its first instance in Western Australia, Major John Henderson, to say a few words. Major. Alcohol Awareness Week is an attempt by a number of concerned organisations to alert members of the general public to the dangers inherent in excessive and abusive drinking. Alcohol Awareness Week has gained recognition and support from the entertainment industry, professional sports organisations, welfare agencies, universities, colleges, schools and the general public. We, had a, we also launched a household survey and we commissioned the McGregor Marketing Company to carry, out, carry that out for us and that produced some very good uh, statistical data relating to the attitudes of the general community to drinking and drinking problems. Two radio stations which had provided support during the two previous state-based Alcohol Awareness Weeks were presented with awards. One company in each state was chosen by an independent organisation experienced in the field to receive an award for care given to workers in the area of alcohol abuse. The 1991 Alcohol Awareness Week Industry Award in South Australia went to General Motors Holden Automotive Limited. Because we work in the entertainment industry more often than not in pubs and clubs, a lot of people assume that it's a necessary uh, condition of our lifestyle that we drink all the time. In fact, uh, for musicians in Australia, our consumption of alcohol is, is wildly exaggerated. You learn very, very quickly in this industry if you're going to succeed in what is a cutthroat, highly competitive area, uh, you need to have your health and your wits about you all the time. Two sports awards were presented by radio personality Ken Cunningham. One was awarded to the Adelaide Football Club and received by coach Graham Corns, patron of Alcohol Awareness Week. It's a, it's a great privilege for me on behalf of the football club to receive the award. It will go to a very worthy recipient and from my personal point of view I congratulate the committee. It was a, a cause with which I wanted to be involved. It is a marvellous cause. The Salvation Army is a particularly marvellous organisation and uh, any help I could have given them I was very pleased to do so. And the other sports award was the 1991 Alcohol Awareness Week Player of the Final Series Netball Award. The winner is from Contacts, Julie Nichol.